If you're going to Ethiopia and you need a visa, you can easily do this online. Once you're on their official website, which I've linked in the description below, go ahead and click on apply now. First, you're gonna be asked what visa you need. If you're just going as a tourist, go ahead and select tourist visa. The visa validity, are you gonna be there just you know, within 30 days, you're not gonna be leaving the country, or do you need multiple entry, 90 days? For the purposes of, of this example, we're gonna select the single entry 30 days, and then click on the I agree to the terms and conditions, and then next. On this page, they want your arrival information. They also want your address in Ethiopia. So go ahead and fill in that information. Once you're done, go ahead and scroll down and click Next. On this page, they just want your personal information. So go ahead and provide all the details requested. And once you're done, go ahead and scroll down and click Next. On this page, they just want your passport information. So go ahead and fill in all the information requested. Once you're done, click Next. On this page, you just need to review your application. Make sure everything is correct. You've spelled your name correctly. Your passport number is correct. You've got your arrival details all correct. Just make sure everything is good to go. And once you're done, go ahead and click Next. On this page, you just need to attach a copy of your passport and a passport style photo. Pay attention to those image restrictions. They want certain sizes and formats. Just make sure everything meets the requirements on this page. And once you're done, go ahead and click Submit. On this page, it's the payment confirmation. What you need to do is select the payment option that works for you. You've got that total amount there. Go ahead and click that you acknowledge all the payments are non-refundable, all that things reads through this page, just make sure you understand everything. And once you're ready, go ahead and click continue payment. On this page, you just need to fill in your card details. Once you're done, go ahead and click make payment. Your visa will arrive to you via email and make sure you print out some copies. I always bring hard copies just in case. And that's it. It's that easy.